and if anyone knows me, my mental health purely depends on how good my smoothies are. assignment. Oh, and I'm upset because it's sunny again, which is like sad. It may have taken me an hour, but it's done. And now to reward myself for doing the bare minimum of one assignment, I'm making coffee. And my iPad has to charge because it's almost dead. So that's a good excuse enough for me. officially up which means I mean business but I've decided not letting myself drink coffee until I finish this assignment so look at him he's coloring with the butterfly okay, so I officially finished that assignment it's 10 11 I'm checking my grades for the other class because I'm curious if he graded an assignment um, and I'm going to go drink my coffee. <sighs> nope. There's one assignment that I'm really nervous about that, like, I feel like I did wrong, and he has not graded it yet. So that should be interesting. to do so I should probably do that but like I truly don't want to 
I think at this point I'm just bribing myself with the fact that if I do this, I'll probably make a fruit smoothie at lunch. I like fruit smoothies. Okay, so I've had to start practicing. Hey Jesper, you okay? Okay, that was a clear no, but I don't know how to help you. Enjoy your pillow time. I just finished practicing. Um, I'll do my second after we eat lunch. But real quick, can we normalize like not being motivated to do the things you love? Because like, don't get me wrong. I get the whole like, oh, if you love something, you should always want to do it. But at the same time, there are some days where you just don't have motivation to do anything. Do cheers. Give a little. I don't want to do this. Cheers. I just ate lunch and had my smoothie, but I'm really freaking tired. So I'm gonna take like a 30 minute nap and regroup. Do you ever one of those days where you wake up and she's not working? Because same. And I'm getting angry. This is like my fourth try. And this one was perfect. But then somebody knocked on the door and it got ruined. And I'm angry and I have to leave in 30 minutes. This is the sound of someone barely holding it together. If I have a 94 in my class with a 66, do I need to redo the assignment that I cried three times over? I don't know. So I'm updating from where we left off. Um, I didn't start my work shift. Oh yeah, by the way, I obviously saw it earlier. I finally got my makeup to work. Had like three mental breakdowns, but it's fine. Um, and now it looks gross because I just got home from work. But I didn't start work till, till 4.15, but we got there early so I could do schoolwork. However, here comes the kicker. This just starts how the evening went. I forgot my earbuds in the car, which sucked. So I really didn't get any schoolwork done. I looked at my grades, um, had a little bit of a moment or those, whatever, started working. It was a, it was a rough shift. So I was on clean play, which is basically where you're doing like deep cleaning tasks the whole night. And I did a little bit of other things, which is fine. I don't have a problem with it. I actually kind of like the cleaning tasks, um, but at the same time, <laughs> it's exhausting. Um, yeah so that was and it was just it was rough obviously i'm not going to go in depth um but yeah it was not great and then came home that's where i'm at now obviously it's like it's like 8 40 something um and we're about to watch a show but yeah i've already stubbed my toe <laughs> three times so clearly you can tell what kind of evening I'm having and I really just want to go to bed. And every time I leave from work, I'm like, oh, I'm going to get stuff done. I'm going to do things when I get home. Nah, mm -mm. nope, too dead inside, too tired. So yeah, now I'm just going to be chilling here Hi. with Jesper, who is freaking out for some reason. But yeah, that's, that's how my day is gone. I'm going to go watch like new girl or something. Hola, so, it's 
16 and I'm in bed right now. I'm about to go to sleep. Go to sleep. Um, so yeah, I've, uh, all we did was watch New Girl and get ready for bed. Did not get as much as I wanted to get done today, if I'm being honest, but at the same time, I said I did stuff and that is literally the most, well, the most typical summer day in my life possible. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you didn't, I mean, it's my life, so like, whatever. But yeah, anyways, shout out to Lily for bringing me Boba. And that's all. Have a good night. Or whatever time it is. Whatever. Peace out.